to Texas politics as early voting wraps up tomorrow. On the ballot are a few local elections, state proposals, and some bonds. Yeah, on the ballot for folks in Hampshire Finette ISD, there are new concession stand for the high school. The old one is 40 years old, and people say it's just falling apart. The $1.4 million bond proposal to fix it was on the agenda as folks came together tonight. Our 12 News reporter Amelia White went to hear the discussion, and most people were in favor of spending a little extra, but one community member said, Said they didn't think it was worth it. That's right, Jordan Dage. Almost everyone I spoke to tonight says despite the price tag, they're ready to demolish the current concession stand and build a brand new one. They believe they can put on better football games with the proper resources. Christy Frazier's eyes are usually glued to the field, rooting for her son on Thursday nights. I would say for it because we are actually losing revenue for the Athletic uh, Booster Club because of this concession stand. But every now and then, her eyes cut over to Hampshire Fournette's unique concession stand. It's raining, it's storming, we can't use it, we can't have as many uh, things to give to the public. And the concession stand isn't the only eyesore. And then also the image. I mean, you walk up and you see porta potties. No one wants to use those. Superintendent Dwayne Augustine has a few solutions up his sleeve. We have a bond proposal for uh, $1.4 million to uh, demolish and then re place our concession facility at the football stadium. This is the original concession stand, but because of rapid deterioration, the high school had no choice to improvise. And so it, 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 it puts a puts a load on, on people who are attending the game. Frazier says she wasn't for this bond proposal at first. I will say the first time it was proposed, I will say I voted against it. We were just given, it's going to cost $1.5 But as she gathered more information, she started to see the bigger picture. This time it's very detailed. They gave us graphics on what's going to be in there. They gave us cost. I mean, it's three cents a day, a dollar a month, what, twelve fifty or so a year. Augustine says it's time to put funds back into the student athletic programs. Not just having proper facilities in terms of serving food, serving uh, patrons with restroom facilities, but also being able to literally pay for itself. So it, it's a need that, that has a great benefit. If the, if the bond is proposed, if the proposal is approved, Superintendent Augustine plans to have the new and improved concession stand ready by December of next year. Amelia White, 12 News. Amelia, thank you. Early voting for the November election ends tomorrow. Election day is this coming Tuesday. Stick with 12 News, your election headquarters on air and online.